well all finished cooking the beans and as you can see that's about oh two-thirds of a bucket and a lot of them have went past the prime seeds are swelling up too large in the pods to use as snap green beans but we'll shell these later tonight and uh, we'll eat them as shelled beans and I'll show you that when we do it so you'll know how to do it too so you just don't throw away your beans that may have went a little bit too long and you're not able to use them as green beans got us a couple of giant cucumbers they went a little bit too long but we'll still use them so now we got to pick a few cherry tomatoes and we still got to pick the blueberries so off we go okay y'all we've made it back in the house it's dark outside and finished picking everything now like i said got us about uh, two-thirds of a bucket of green beans here and a lot of them it went past their prime uh the beans inside is swollen up they'll still be nice and tender the ones that are not suitable for snapping we'll shell them I'll show you in a minute just how to do that in case you never have. Went ahead and picked the blueberries. We got nearly a full bowl. I'd say it's about two pounds or more. And about ten uh, cherry tomatoes there. Enough for me to drop on a salad or two. And we were able to find a couple of uh, small red ripe tomatoes. They're hiding in one of our pockets parks whopper tomato plants and finally we found hiding three rather large cucumbers now two of them are larger than I would like this one here might still be okay for fresh eat the other two large ones I'll be cutting them in half I'll scrape the seeds out and I'll still cut them up and what I'll do with them is chop them up put them in salads. Still usable. But anyway, we did let the cucumbers go a little bit long as we did the beans. Let me show you something here on these beans right now. So you'll know how to do this in case for whatever circumstances, a holiday, vacation, or whatever, you let your green beans go a little bit too far too. So hold on. So, what we're going to do is we're going to take this nice big one right here. You can see all the beans are nice and plump in it. And all you're going to do is you're going to split that bean open. You see inside it right there? You see those nice, tender green beans in there? You're going to go ahead and get those out. Right there we go. See them? Now they're still fresh and uh, tender. And what we'll do with those, with the beans that we can snap, we'll add these in. And it's what they call shelly beans. You can actually go to your favorite grocery store and buy shelly beans, which are the shell green beans with the snap beans in a can. They'll eat just fine. So I just wanted to show you that real quick so you if you should let your beans go you won't just throw them away. They'll still be saved. You can shell them, cook them, and eat them. And maybe I'll do a video and show you just how to cook them up. But folks, that's it for today. We picked the beans, picked our blueberries and some cherry tomatoes, a couple of small tomatoes here. It's not much, but you know, it's not like I need much or that I have that much planted. And we got us a few cucumbers. So until next time, folks, we'll see you on the next video.
Y'all take care. Stay safe. And God bless you. Goodbye for now.